Cardhop has the ability to work with multiple contact accounts. For instance, if you have iCloud and Exchange, Cardhop can do that. Let me show you. I'm gonna tap on the Groups button, and you can see it lists two different account types here. I've got the Exchange with two cards, and iCloud with over a thousand. I can select groups from both of them to display at the same time. So I'll click Done, and there you see is a mixture of my Exchange and my iCloud cards. Now from here, if I want, I can move a card from one account to the other. For instance, let's say I wanna take this account, or this contact, and I wanna move it over to Exchange. I just hit the Edit button, then I scroll down where it says Accounts, tap on that, and then just tap on Exchange. And now it's gonna move this card over to Exchange. When I click Save, it's going to prompt me to say, hey, are you sure you wanna do that? Yes, I do. I'll hit Change Account, and now I've done it. So now I have that card. If you look at it now, hit Edit again, scroll to the bottom, you'll see that it is in the Exchange account where there are now three cards. In addition to moving your cards between accounts with CardHop, you can also give a custom name to your account and tell it what your preferred account is. To do that, go to the Settings button and then scroll down and pick your default account right here. So I'll tap it and you can pick your default account, whether it's iCloud or Exchange. And if you hit the Edit button, you can type the uh, little information button next to it and um, then you can give it a new name. CardHop also has the ability to search additional directories. You can enable that in the settings under the directories button. And here you can add accounts from Google, Exchange, or Office 365 to search in your directories. I've got Google enabled here, but if I wanted to add another one, you would just tap on the add directory button and add your directory information. So now I've returned to CardHop and uh, done a search for Elliot Phonehum, and you can see that is showing up with a directory match, and that means it's showing up on my Google account. I can tap on that contact and get the contact details. No matter where you keep your contacts, CardHop can help you.